in that form this year, but certainly he's coming into nice form. Good to see Jack Green back after a couple of years out of action. He's around 49.05 this year, European under-23 champion five years ago. Jose Ronaldo Ben Cosme of Italy goes in seven. And on the outside, it's uh, Giel of Germany. Giel with the best of 49.75. So all but the two athletes on the inside lanes have run well inside 50 seconds for the event. And, of course, the quickest of the lot is the defending champion, Karim Hussein of Switzerland, who goes in lane five. Just two short to go through to the final. We had a qualifying round yesterday, but this is where all the big men come into action. The first of three semi-finals. Adamczyk, Muller, Barholm, Gutierrez, Hussein, Green, Ben Cosme and Gio. Hussein goes in lane five, the defending champion, and he's certainly off well with Jack Green just outside him. Good start also by Ben Cosme of Italy further out. And uh, Varholm has started really well, the young Norwegian, who is already up on Kuchero of Slovakia outside him, has made a much more controlled start. And Varholm it is who rises first with Ben Cosme and Giel also going very well in those outside lanes. And it's still Varholm. Being challenged now by uh, Hussein. Varholm in three on the inside, this young Norwegian talent who took part in both of the Catherine and the 400 hurdles in those under 23 chances. Look at the strength here of Hussein coming through. Kuchero finishing fast, Jack Green finishing fast. But it's on the line, it's Varholm just from Hussein, from uh, Green and Kuchera in that order. A good race, good time too. 48 85 shown on the clock. What a breakthrough for this young man. He Big really personal is... best there for Varholm and a new Norwegian record. Well, he's per and he smashed his personal best when he ran 49-45. He's made two very big leaps in, in form. But he's such a talent. He, when he competes in the Norwegian under-23 championships, he does about seven events. And look at the strength of him here. Hussein finished well. So too Jack Green. Uh, but both he and Kuchero will have to see whether their times are quick enough. They're good times. Varholm's time confirmed is 48.84, Hussein 48.87, Green has seized his best, 48.90, and that it'll be a little bit of a surprise almost if he doesn't go through to the final with that time. And Kuchera, 49 seconds exactly. So uh, that really does send a marker down for the other heats. But this man, a real outstanding young talent. <laughs> Big hug there from European Athletics President Sven Arne Hansen, also a Norwegian. Very pleased to see one of his compatriots do him well. No, it was a superb run and well, well, well timed as well. He did look as though he was running out of steam just a little bit with Hussein bearing down on him over the final hurdle, but he managed to hold his form on the run in over the final 50 metres and it was a terrific run. One only wonders what more we're going to see in the final. Well, yeah, indeed. I mean, he's taken a huge chunk and he's uh, taken some scalps. A couple of men who've run appreciably quicker than him before. There is the confirmed result of semi-final one. Varholm, the Norwegian record at 48.84. Hussein, 48.87. Green, 48.98. Kuchera, a personal best, 49.08. And Giel, 49.50. A big improvement for the German on his personal best. Adamczyk, also personal best. Good conditions here, as is evident from those times. A terrific race there with four personal bests best and I'm just looking down here I mean it's still a long way in advance the European under 23 record of 47.85 which was held by the great Harold Schmidt since 1979 but well Varholm seven more years in the ranks as we look back to another Scandinavian from over the border Marcus Nilsson had a good throw in the opening round a personal best well I think that's a second personal best in as many throws through just under 63 meters with his opening throw and I think that's an improvement came into this competition with 6202 he doesn't look very emotional about it 6401 well 